we do a couple of these together, I just want to point out, you know, like in the first word problem, it's the same as these up here, except you're just finding the height. Okay, they drew the picture for you. <laughs> same thing here. This word problem, they drew the picture for you. They're just looking for the, what the distance is between the two houses. 39. Angle of depression and angle of elevation. You remember? They're the same. So this would be 20 right here. Now, it's hard to see this if you're not looking closely. Elevation, you know, is how far above sea level you are. Yeah. If you're 5,500 at the top of the hill, this is skiing, and you're 5,018 at the bottom, can you figure out what X is? You just subtract them, right? So you find X first, and then you can find D by doing like we did up here. The real tricky one is this one. They want just the handle. So when you do this, though, just treat it like it's a regular right triangle. Find this whole length right here, because you know this is 30, and then just subtract 26 off. That'll give you the handle. Does that make sense? Yeah. Yep. So if you find the whole thing, take off 26. That'll give you the handle. Okay. So these are all using the trig functions. We'll do a couple together. Round to the nearest ten. So here's the angle given, 6 is opposite, if I'm looking for x, that's the hypotenuse. So it's opposite hypotenuse, so it's sine. Sine. Sine of 37 is 6 over x. So when the x is on the bottom, you just flip those two, or switch those two, I mean. So 6 divided by sine of 37. If you don't know how to check your calculator, See if it's in degrees, let me know and I'll show you. You could just try it now. You should get 9.96, which would round to 10. 10. 9.969848. Yep. Then, once you have that, everyone here, can you use the Pythagorean theorem? Yep. That's the quickest way to find the third one. Wait, I thought we found the hypotenuse. We did, I just put X underneath here. Okay. So this is 10, so you'd go 10 squared minus 6 squared, and square root? 8. 8. So remember, when you do the Pythagorean theorem, if it's a leg you're looking for, you square them and subtract them in square root. If it's a hypotenuse you're looking for, you square them and add them in square root. Okay, so for 29, here's the angle. This is the hypotenuse. I'll just do the adjacent one, just for something different. So that's cosine. Cosine of 23 <laughs> is adjacent over hypotenuse. S over 34. So this one, all you do is take it times 34. Three. 31.29, which is 31.3. So then to find T, use the Pythagorean theorem, you would just take 34 squared minus 31.3 squared and square root it. Yep, 13.3.